So if you have a Solus inverter and you change your internet provider or change your modem, your Wi-Fi data logger, which is this silver stick sticking out of the bottom hand, right hand corner of your inverter, is going to lose connection and your app is going to stop working. In order to reconnect it to your new Wi-Fi, the first thing you must do is ensure that your Wi-Fi networks in your home are separated and that the 2.4 GHz network is clearly identifiable in your Wi-Fi settings. If you don't know how to log into your modem and separate the Wi-Fi bands, you can call your internet provider and they can do this remotely for you. To then connect the Solus data logger to your new 2.4 GHz Wi-Fi network, the first thing you must do is go to your inverter and go to the data logger. On the back of the data logger, you can feel a reset button and if you look around the back, you'll also see it. What you must do is press and hold this reset button down for a good 20 to 30 seconds and watch the two lights on the data logger that say net and com. When both of them turn off, you can let the button go and wait about 20 to 30 seconds. So what you now want to do is go to your Solus Cloud app, open your Solus Cloud app and down the bottom right hand side you should see an option that says service. Click on service and then you'll see the option for Wi-Fi configuration. Click on Wi-Fi configuration. It's now asking you to input the data logger serial number or you can take a picture by pressing on the square barcode option at the end. It should open up your camera and it asks you to scan the QR code on your data logger. Simply hold your phone in front of it and it will input the serial number for you. Click next and select browser configuration. Your green light on your data logger should be flashing so you can select I'm sure it's flashing. Now it's asking you to connect to the data logger network. Simply just press go to connect and it will open your Wi-Fi settings on your phone. I can see the Solus network in here so I need to select it. Enter the password which is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Click the I symbol just to make sure you've entered it correctly and click connect. If the message pops up, internet may not be available, this is normal, and just select connect only this time. So now you can see it's connected without internet. Now you need to go back to your Solus app and proceed to the next step. Do this on Android by pressing the back button. So the next step then is to connect your data logger to your home Wi-Fi network. So on the right hand side you can see the arrow, click to connect to router, you select this and it will show you the available Wi-Fi networks in your home. So select the 2.4 gigahertz network that you have allocated in your home. So when you've selected your correct Wi-Fi network and entered your password, you click the next button and if successful, it should pop up configuration complete. You should notice that your phone should disconnect from the Wi-Fi. You can press OK and then look for the green light that says net on the data logger if it goes solid green it's been successful you can then go back to your solus cloud app and it should show that the system is now online and working as before